if you have some idea about javascript and want to learn react js this is the easiest video you could ever find in youtube to get started just go to google.com don't ask me what is google and inside it search for react js download click on the first link and you will see download starter kit whatever is the latest version click on this link and react would be get downloaded whenever you open this downloaded gif file you will see like one folder react with the latest version you are looking at double click on this you will see build inside build you will see like five different javascript files and out of this you need two to get started the react.min.js and jsx transformer now i would like to copy these two wherever i want to write my code so i will go to in my documents i will create a folder say react try and inside react try i will just drag this to file we will create our html file at the same location where we have these two javascript by using a text editor and i would be using sublime text in here i will create an html file and we'll save it in the same location by giving it a name fast.html and here we'll get the react library react.min.js and the second script will get the transformer and we have jsx transformer dot js all my javascript to use react js would be the next script block and in this script block i have to tell browser that i would be using a special type of script and name of the script would be text slash jsx and we will talk more about jsx later to create the first component i will give it as a name like variable and name of the component would be message and the way we would be creating a component is exactly the same way we will create a class we will call react dot create class and when we would be calling this create class we have to pass an object and this object can have multiple method but one method is mandatory and the name of the method is render so we will have render method and this would be a function and inside this function we will return some html that we want to see in the component so we will return a basic h1 tag so we will create h1 hello world and we will close our h1 that's all you need to create a component in react js to see this react component on your web page you have to do two things first thing is you have to have a dom elements where you want to show this component so we will create a dom elements here and we will simply create a div and i will give an id would be my div and here we will call react dot render and first thing we have to pass is the component in an html tag and we'll create the enclosing and pass my component message close this tag and second parameter i have to pass the elements where i want to put this component so we can simply call this div by using document dot get element by id pass my div and that's all we need to do to create our first component we will save it and go to the folder where i have first dot html and we'll double click it to open it if you want to change something on your component like instead of hello world you will say hello react save it go to the website and refresh it you have hello react 